what is up trading card gang i just whacked this camera and we're gonna keep going uh so as you can see i have lost origins and silver tempest pokemon center boxes here uh elite trainer box centers Blah. elite trainer poke pokemon center elite trainer boxes Blah. okay as you can see i'm alone sean's not here I keep forgetting him tell him we gotta record so he's just kind of like okay cool i guess and then i upload a video and he's like cool uh we are trying to get a podcast going uh working on a name i kind of think we may have locked it down i started working on a logo we'll see uh zach's all down for that too so stick around for that anyway enough with the uh intro stuff let's get into the boxes we're gonna start with the uh, lost origins i really need to remember to pull a knife out before i start recording but i do have one on me this time and while I'm at it, let me just get this started. Okay. All right. So, Lost Origins, Elite Trainer box. Kind of been out for a while now. Uh, the book of all the cards, you don't care about that. That is sweet. I have not opened this up or seen anybody open these. So that is really cool. Intr the inner card board stuff is also really cool it's just the cover art for the packs you get your typical stuff though you get your sleeves you get your code card you get the most important part the energies the card dividers you get your typical dice although that's really cool it's got a giotina's face on it you get your coin and we get a pin i love pins i'm a major pin collector so that is a plus to that. Let's get this stuff back in there real quick. Okay. Now we got the packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten packs. Okay. Not bad, not bad. We're gonna kind of fly right through these because we got that to open as well in this episode, and there's just a lot of cards. So, code. Three, four. These cards feel weird today. Fire. Uh, Carbank, Panic Mask, Lampant, Ghastly, Ducklet, Zoro, Binkle, Gumi, Reverse Hall, Ducklet, and a Parasect. Um, so, when this episode comes out, the uh, new Pokemon game comes out. I will be playing it. Um, I might start recording some stuff for it. So, let me know in the comments down below if you want to see... Some let's plays. Ooh, a Radiant Gardevoir and a Naratina V. What? Okay, that is awesome. Awesome. Okay. As I was saying, I'm gonna be playing it. Uh, I'm getting Scarlet. I know most people really like the Violet, like Legendary dude, but I think Scarlet's looks better. Honestly, it's more colorful. Less penis looking. So that's always good. Uh, psychic. Uh, but yeah, I might do a let's play with that. I don't know if I'll do a full let's play, but definitely at least a couple episodes of Rodham V. Nice, nice. So let me know. Uh, I'm even not 100% certain on who I'm going to go for starter yet. Leaning towards Fluicoco. So it's probably going to be him. I haven't looked at any of the leaked deck stuff, so I'm a little disappointed that we don't know. I think my thumb was covering that code don't know uh the like other evolutions of them i don't even think we know the full decks of what's in the game which is really weird uh electric so i'm probably just gonna ooh, we got a trainer card cast form and a spear tomb uh so i'm probably gonna like double check once the game releases uh, I'm recording this the day before, so tomorrow to find out what the heck they look like for their third forms. Because I don't really care if their second forms look stupid, because you kind of just blitz through that anyway. A fire, uh, but I definitely care about their third forms. Toolbox and chandelier. So yeah, let me know in the comments down below. Are you getting the game? Which version are you getting? Uh, what's your starter? 
What do you think of all the new uh, dog Pokemon? Because now I can make an even better dog team than I had in the last games, which are obviously the best. Uh, I didn't even guess that one, so whatever. Uh, Shellos and Clefable. But yeah, um, I'm not even gonna bother with the trick. We're just gonna go right through it. Scoobert, uh, Gliscor, okay. We're just gonna we're just gonna blitz through these next couple packs, so we can get to that set. Ooh, a Delphox V. This will be, I think, my first fire starter in a while that I'm choosing, because uh, usually I've been going grass lately. And don't get me wrong, Litten's cute. Quaxley, also really cute. I love the sassiness of Quaxley. But uh, I really want to go with a cool one this time. Usually I go with the cute one. I did the trick. I don't know why. Lantern and an Aerodactyl V Star! Woohoohoo! Damn, these are some good pulls. Damn. Um, I'm really excited for this game. I, uh, some of my friends in the friend group are less excited, and I know why they are, and I understand why they are. Uh, to me, though, I'm not taking it as big of a deal anymore. I'm just going to probably play the main story, and if that keeps me interested enough to start playing the uh, after-game stuff, then I'm going to play the after-game stuff. I'm also really excited about the idea of being able to uh, play four-player co-op. Um, so, like, for me, that's the cool parts. Player's Guide, typical stuff. Silver Tempest. Uh, this was, this fell right out. The dice. We got the sleeves. Ooh, they're Lugia sleeves. That's way cooler. Typical. What's the coin? The coin is Vulpix. We've got the uh, dividers, which is Vulpix. We've got the energies, which is important. Ooh, we got two sets of card sleeves. Ooh. I'm trying to get you guys the code card here, but it does not want to come out. All right, let's get the stuff that we don't need in our way out of the way real quick, and we'll uh, get right into this next, next set, which is... Uh, Silver Tempest, two, four, six, eight, yep, ten packs. Ten packs. Let's see if Silver Tempest has even better pulls. I will do the card trick. I don't think I'm going to guess right now. So we have the better order of stuff. Bullpix is cute. Growlithe. All right, and a Zygird. 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 Another kind of dog boy, honestly. Fourth. And worker, Sunfloor. We got a Fungus. An emergency Jelly and a Zeru. So far, I'm looking good. I'm looking good. But we got plenty of packs still, so we got, we got, we got hope. We got hope. Keep up the hope. All right, and ooh, we got unknown V star. We got an unknown V star. So we got a V star in both so far. Unknown. I know some people love unknown, and other people think it's the dumbest thing. I'm kind of meh, to be honest. Just kind of meh about unknown. There, they're kind of, they're cool, I guess. I mean, I never put them on my team, but they were interesting. They came in so many different fun shapes and stuff. Incineroar! Incineroar! What's been your favorite set for this uh, generation? Because I believe this is the end of this uh, generation's set for the uh, Sword and Shield. And it should be going into the uh, uh, Violet and... Uh, Scarlet. 
snort and an Arcanine B, baby! Heck yeah! It's Zooian Arcanine B. Arcanine, one of my faves. One of my faves. He's such a good, fluffy boy. Two, three. Alright. Well, Lord, well, Burr. We got a Flaffy V. We got another full art. And a Rapidash. Rapidash. Also, really cool. Really cool shiny Pokemon is Rapidash. Rapidash is so cool as a shiny. I don't know if that's viewable where I put it, but I'm moving it just in case. I'm actually now curious if they like kind of preset these to where they get these certain ones in the set. And that's why I'm doing this. Out of curiosity. Uh, Turricat, Dragonair, Togodama, Togodamaru, Esper, Smeagol, Litten, Pitlily, a Duraludon B Max, and a Talon Flame. Okay, we got three packs left. Three packs left to try and defunct that theory or prove it. I kind of just had this theory as I was going. I know I didn't say anything about it, but now I'm saying something about it because uh, I kind of just noticed it as I was opening. An Articuno, heck yeah. I'll always take one of the original legendary birds. What's your favorite legendary bird? If it's, um, if it's not Articuno, then you're just wrong. I'm kidding. I actually love uh, Zapdos. The most. We got one pack left. Do we pull another V card in here? Of the ten packs, is this gonna be a V card? If so, I'm calling out a Pokemon conspiracy theory. We got Dark Energy. We got Venomoth. Wallace. Jinx. Chincho. Pharisee. Pikachu. Ponyta. Venonat. We got Lance. And a. Uh, Reunoculus. So, theory defunct, maybe? Maybe I should get some more uh, different sets and try again. Would you? I'll see you next week. Maybe with Sean if I remember to say something to him. Anyway, goodbye. <laughs>